So this series, Choppers for Dumbers. Choppers for Dumbers. Dumbers for Choppies. Dummies for Choppers. What's up guys, welcome back to Party On Forever. I'm Andy and this is Choppers for Dummies. Yeah, dude, this is a 1993 Harley Sportster 1200. It's got 47,000 miles on it. It's been ridden hard, ridden fast. We're gonna strip this thing all the way down to the frame and the motor and build it back up. Get this thing ripping, you know? Somewhere in between the choppery, sportstery, bobbery, cool thing. But before we get into that, I do want to encourage you guys to stop by my merch store and pick up a shirt. I'm not trying to be a commercial here. I'm not trying to uh, sell you a bunch of shit. I am, I'm trying to sell you a bunch of shit. But the reason is, I love doing this. This channel, first, is for fun. Two, it's to start a community between me and you and everybody and uh, just be able to bounce ideas and questions off each other. If you like what we're doing, maybe think about going and picking up a shirt. Click the subscribe button. Hit like, tell your friends about it. Whatever, dude. I'm gonna do it whether you buy a shirt or not. What is a chopper? I don't care, man. A chopper is all about the mindset. It's all about what you got in here and what you got in here. We weren't all born into this. We didn't all have fathers that taught us how to use wrenches and tools. We didn't have that cool uncle that had a welder and taught us how to do some metal fab. Uh, maybe you were a punker and you went on tour for 10 years and traveled the world playing music. But the whole point of this channel is just to encourage each other to live our best lives. That's a funny phrase, live your best life. But the way I mean it is to try hard, try things. You don't know how to do it. Don't sit on your butt and wait and wait and wait and wait for the courage. Just do it, man. Motorcycles are dangerous. If you get into something that's in over your head and you don't think you can handle it, outsource it out to somebody else. But there's a lot of really easy shit that you and me can do on bikes that are gonna make them cool or make them run better. And you know, it's all just about learning, dude. Take your air cleaner off, cut it up, put a new one on, whatever, dude. Choppers for dummies. We're gonna do like, you know, four, five, six, 100 part series, who knows, man. First few things that I do is just Pull the seat off, pull the tank off, pull the fenders off. Um, here's how it's gonna go. We're gonna tear it down, get it all the way down to the frame and the motor, you know, maybe keep the oil tank in there, we'll see. Uh, then we are going to rewire the entire bike. After rewiring, we're gonna be working on suspension and brakes, just making sure that the brakes are all good. I heard they were pretty spongy, so we're gonna work on those. Might be swapping out the suspension for um, some different shocks. After that, we're gonna be working on handlebars, hand controls, new mid controls, and get rid of these four controls. Then after that, we're gonna be dealing with some pipes, putting a different carb on here, get it running right, and make it look nice. So, you know, we're not gonna cut the and frame in half and turn it into a chopper. We're gonna dip our toes into chopper into the chopper lake a little bit. Dip, 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 dip your toes into the lake of the chopper gods. So anyway, we're gonna tear this baby down. Yo, I realized that during some of these time-lapse sections, you're thinking, man, I wish I could actually see what exactly he's doing. Maybe you do or don't know your way around uh, fasteners, tools, bikes, you're trying to get into this stuff for the first time. These videos will be two hours long if I showed you every individual fastener that you gotta take off and how to do it and what size tool you need and all that. It's all trial and error. Go through your toolbox, find the things that you need, Jab it until it works, and if you don't have the tool you need, go to the store and get it. Uh, Google things, send me an email or message and ask uh, what size tool you need for certain fasteners, and I'll try to get you that information. 
really, it's just you trying to figure things out. All this is is me just doing it in front of you um, and you being like, oh man, if that fat dude can do it, if that fat dumb dude can do it, I can do it. And so, um, back into the time lapse, you know? Well, that about wraps up this video. Thanks for tuning in. I'm gonna clean this thing up, put a rag on it, get a little shiny so the next time I work on it, my hands don't get disgusting again. Keep your bikes clean, people. And then the next video, we're gonna address all this rat's nest of wires and get rid of it. If you got wiring issues or wanna learn more about wiring, click subscribe, hit like, hit the little bell, ding, 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 because of this next one gonna be a hairy one. If you like what we're doing here, hit subscribe, hit like. The best way you can support me in this channel is telling your friends about what we're doing. Also, I got merch online. Like I said, partyonforever.com. Pick up a shirt. Every single cent and dollar helps to keep more of these videos happening. And First Manufacturing Co., 25% off. Get some cool gear. They make great clothes, great riding gear, whether you ride or whether you just chore or whatever your thing is. They got something for you. Tune in next week. Keep on chorn, party on forever.